Hi there folks, this is MarkyMan64 here and you join me for another episode of Let's Play Super Mario 64. Um, we're up to 38 stars now for anyone who hasn't watched the previous episodes. Where have you been? But um, we're going to do something special this time. We're going to go back into Bomb on Battlefield Course 1. Uh, which we have completed except for one thing. We have not yes. yet got the hundred coin star. So we're going to go for that now. So the best star to go for most of the the hundred coin ones is the red coins. Just because they normally have a hundred coins. They normally have the most coins. Um, there's not a lot of courses that have any different numbers of coins from star to star, but there are some. So we're going under here. Oh, hang on. There we are. And okay, we're going to basically kill as many enemies as possible. This is one of the easiest hundred coin. Um, searches and just bear in mind that you know uh, gold coins are worth one, uh, red coins are worth two and blue coins are worth five so that's an important thing to remember so just get as many of the of the red coins as possible as well try not to avoid them because they are quite important Especially in some of the some of the courses, you need to get all the red coins. Have any chance of getting the hundred? But yeah, all the goompas there. Goompas are, are again are, are completely useless at remembering the the name of them. Goom goompas goompas. It's really hard to pronounce. That is how I, I read it. It's not me, you know, being wrong. Okay, and this guy is worth five, but he does, he can run up there, which we obviously can't. So can the Goompas, apparently. Okay, so get him cornered like that, and try and jump on his shell, but, uh, I mean, you really do need him, don't you? So, yeah, try and get him. Try your best. Let him come to you. I'm not dangerous. I'm not going to steal your shell. Ugh! Yeah, Lorna, my girlfriend, she has a, a tortoise called Troy. There you go. There's the five coins that I was looking for. Now, I can't remember whether that is. No, okay. Fair enough. Okay, so, coming down here, yeah, hitting a wall because that destroys the, um, the shell, but I, yeah, Lona owns a tortoise, and so I don't think she'd like that scene, because, um, yeah, although that doesn't, that can't actually happen with, with tortoises, um, the creators of the game thought it was they would just add it in the feature of removing the, the shell of a of one of them so that come on pick up <laughs> yeah because physically um, the shells of tortoises are attached to the Oh, I think the word is exoskeleton, they're attached to their, their skeletons basically, and so it, it can't happen, but, like I say, it's quite fun, you know, and it's, it's something that you don't take it too seriously, like many things in this game, you can't take things too seriously, just in general, you know. In your everyday life, don't take things too seriously. Really. Okay, so let's kill these guys. This is just basically, you know, a, I mean, you get to explore the map, I guess. Places that you might not have been to. 
and there's a special thing about the tree chunks here and that they spit out coins when you go around them I think it's four times five times one two three four okay um so try and get as many of those coins as possible again there's a lot of spare coins in this level but in a lot of them you have to get pretty much every one. I don't think there's any that are a hundred coins exactly. I'm pretty sure um, the closest is like 103 or something in one of the levels. But just try and get as many as possible in this one. This is mainly you know a practice level for the hundred coin search because it is a bit easier than some of the others. Okay, so that's 60 coins. So if my math serves me right, that's 61. So that is... Oh, cool. The bubble killed that bomb on. I don't like the bubbles. I really don't. And there's double... Double the number in this... In this star because... Uh, after the after King Bomom is defeated, um, yeah. By the way, that's a gate to open that. I think we've already seen that one in the red coin set. But um, yeah, after you defeat King Bomom, there's like double the the bombs and you know double everything just to make things a bit more complicated. Come on, life. <laughs> okay. And there's like three bombs here and they're going faster and there's a lot more bombs coming down the, the mountain. So we're going to go up here and then let ourselves drop down and I think this is going to be the, the only time that you've seen me go up the mountain manually because we've been using shortcuts and stuff all the time but oh well. And yeah, don't worry about the the health thing, um, like the, how the stars, how the oh, how the coins replenish your health. That does that doesn't affect the the, the coin count. So even if the coins are being used for health, you you know you don't get. Oh, I know what I mean. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. Oh, come on. Okay, I didn't think there was any coins in there, that's a bit annoying. But yeah, the coins go towards your coin count, basically. So yeah, we're going along here, and oh, before I was used to this game, I did not know how to long jump, and oh, I remember that. I kind of forgot it, to be honest with you, because it was kind of bad. And this is also an alternative way to go across to the island, which I think we're going to have to do, which is a bit annoying. Then um, my top tip, do as I, uh, another case of do as I say, not as I do. Um, don't, don't do the order that I'm doing them in, because that's not a good order. Try and go to the island first and get some of the floating coins um, because the star basically appears where where you get the hundred coin. So if you get the hundred coin where these floating coins are, then you know you. Oh, I forgot to pick up the wing cap there. That was a bit silly. Um, yeah, if the if the star appears where the uh, what am I trying to say? If the star appears where those coins are, if you get the hundred coin and it's one of those coins that's floating, the star will be floating. The star doesn't appear down here, you know, convenient like the red coin search star appears. Um, so I'm just trying to think how to get back up there. Okay, we're going back across this bridge. I don't think I've ever went across the bridge this way. That's how much of a failure I'm being this time. 
So we've got 93 coins out of the 100 now. So we're going to try and get, you know, um, 98 of the from the floating coins. Ah, that's a bit annoying. And then use the... Oh, that bomb is a bit glitchy. You won't get coins when enemies respawn. Um, yeah, and then get the last two as being the red coin on top of the tree because that's the easiest place to get it. Well, I mean there's plenty of easy places but right now it's the easiest place to get it because I forgot about that, my own rule that I've just told you about. So yeah, again, do as I say, not as I do. Okay, so remember the wing cap so that we don't need to climb back up to you. To be honest with you, I had a star already to do um, after this, but we're not going to have enough time. It's a bit annoying. Ah, that's exactly what I never wanted to do. But did we get it? I think we might have got it. Yes! We got it! So that was 102 coins that we got. Not all of the coins, but all of those floating ones, we're not going to get them. So you've collected a hundred coins. Mario gains more power from the castle. From the castle, do you want to save? Yes, we want to save. Okay, so that ideally that um, you do the hundred coins when you're doing another star. Um, like I say, mostly the the red coin search. But um, yeah, we've got all but one or something, haven't we? Two, four, six, seven. Yeah. So do it while we're, you're doing the red coin search and you won't need to exit like that. But don't worry, we've got 39 stars up in the corner. So yeah, like like I say, I had a coin, a, a star all planned out and stuff. And even I had two stars planned out because I, I have been finishing episodes really early um, and I've realised that. So I had one star planned out just in case that took really short time and then I had two planned out just in case I did that star really quickly. So yeah, we'll do them next time. I won't spoil the secret um, but we will be going into a new uh, course that we haven't seen yet, I'll tell you that. But um, as for what one, I won't tell you that. Um, also I've been meaning to say, don't go to sleep Mario because that will disturb people. I've been meaning to say that if you're watching this Let's Play when it's a current Let's Play, i.e. I've not finished it, then please feel free and uh, you know, make a suggestion of, of what world you want to see, what course, and even what star you want to see, um, because I'd be happy to, to try them. I've received some requests of some of my least favourite worlds in the whole game, and I will get to them, but if you have any suggestions, then please let me know. Um, yeah, just comment, subscribe, uh, like my videos if you want to. Um, I'm not the sort of person who wants to, I don't want to say that, but um, I've been watching a lot of videos where people have said that, so I don't think anyone will mind. But anyway, um, we'll leave it there, and join us again for an another episode of Let's Play Super Mario 64. Thanks for watching everyone, bye.